Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Spyro 3. In the last episode, we uh, kicked the sorceress's butt, we beat the last sparks level, we got our revenge on money backs, and this, in this episode, we are back for the super bonus round with... Nicholas Cage. <laughs> <laughs> I need to think of a different one after that. Uh, we had a bit of a dirt recording and I was going to say, Lara Croft! <laughs> no, I just come up with another celebrity and I was racking my brains again. Oh my god, no. who is it going to be? Who is it going to be? <gasps> Nicholas Cage. I'm sorry. <laughs> <Why not? laughs> I, I messed hey up. I messed up. <laughs> Angel in trading here. Yes. How y'all doing? <laughs> also, you might have been able to tell that I had 15,001 gems. There is a gem usually here in the corner, but because the recording failed, that gem is not there anymore, and I already have it. <laughs> Thankfully, we didn't do anything else, so all of this is still legit. Oh, rainbow power! Hey, finally made it, Spyro. Hunter was a little worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress, but I always knew you'd beat her. Bianca had faith in that faith in us apparently. <laughs> yeah, like how she just kind of like flicks up her head. <laughs> <laughs> yep. This place is where the sorceress kept all her treasure. But after she was defeated, a bunch of thieves came and stole it. If you can catch the thieves, you're more than welcome to keep the treasure. Yep. So uh, that's all we really do in this level. We collect gems. It's kind of like the bonus level in Spiral One. Except it's much bigger. And takes and a lot longer. <laughs> yeah. There's there's five thousand gems in here, I believe. And uh five thousand. Yep. This level also so much stuff. Yeah. <laughs> and most of it is uh well, most of it you don't really pick up. This is only this is one of you one of the few areas where you actually pick the gems up. <laughs> Oh, I should mention these, these gem doors right here. You need uh, a certain number of gems to get in them. They're like mini-games. Alright, oh, <laughs> they're like the more gems you collect, the more of the world you can see. Yeah. This whole level, I believe, is... Oh my is, god, uh... so many! <laughs> oh yeah, uh, even a bunch of purple ones. <laughs> oh god. Oh no! <laughs> uh, died on the bonus level. I died on the bonus died level. Died on the bonus level. Yep. Well done, sir. <laughs> Well done. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a maybe it's a good thing because I missed that gem apparently. These thieves are getting really annoying. Maybe I should try catching one and show you what happens. Well, it's not really that amazing, but just to show you. I like holding nothing. Woo! Gems. They're, <laughs> they're holding nothing, but it's gems galore when you hit them. They explode into gems. They do. <laughs> so do those uh, those boxes. I don't want to die. <laughs> They're like pinatas. Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> Running pinatas. Yes. Uh, this one's kind uh, of annoying. Yeah. So you kind of have to pinch. jump around to get to them. Also, this whole level, by the way, is based off of uh, Lost Fleet. It uses Lost Fleet's original theme. Um, this, this, like this music was the original music for Lost Fleet until uh, the Greatest Hits got that new theme. And especially when we get to the mini games, you'll see why I say that this was based off of Lost Fleet. It's... I don't know, I have mixed feelings about it. I feel like they could have come up with something original, but they didn't. It's mostly a copy of what Lost Fleet was. Even though one of the mini games in here is really cool, I have to give them that. I do like the Lost Fleet music, though. It's pretty cool. Yeah, the Lost, the Lost Fleet, Fleet music is good. Although it just suits Lost Fleet a bit better. <laughs> yeah, it definitely suits Lost Fleet better than this place. I kind of wish they had mixed up the, the the themes for those. Here, we have another gem door. I I don't think we have enough gems to do anything yet because we need sixteen thousand to. Uh, oh, there's even gem gems laying around still. Somewhere. Oh, no. <laughs> right there. There we go. Up here. Yep. We need 16,000 gems to open the first door, and I think this will give it to us. Yes, maybe. <laughs> As we slow oh, no. almost. Almost. I think there's there should be one more thief then, because according to Sparks, there's no more uh, straight gems, so... There we go. Oh, there, yeah. <laughs> he just, like, ran straight into you. Was that one or two? 
It sounded like there were two, but I... No, I, I think I think there's only one, I'm pretty sure. So uh, let's just head into the first bonus section and not worry about it. It's a bonus section in a bonus level. <laughs> bonus within a bonus within a bonus. Hey, Hunter! Hunter how you, you see doing? Bianca? She was really worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress. It was pretty funny. <laughs> they say the exact cool, same thing about each other. Yeah, they do. They're like a married safe. couple. Or something. I just finished fixing up an old submarine. Why don't you try taking it for a spin? Great! Hop aboard! So, uh, this submarine, does this look familiar? <laughs> just a little bit. Just a little bit? Does it look familiar now? Because <laughs> you're pretty much doing the same thing, except these, I believe, don't drop mines on you, and if you shoot them... Well, if I can get the lock on... Gems galore! Gems! <laughs> so many gems. I just realized it's 20 past 3 and I haven't even had lunch yet. Oh, maybe you should sometime <laughs> soon. <laughs> I was thinking to myself, oh, we'll be quick. Oh well. <laughs> I, I like I I, I I shouldn't really eat this plate, but I'll, I'll eat straight after we finish. <laughs> <laughs> Which just make a sausage roll or something. Yeah. We're actually recording this not too long after I got back from uh, what is pro probably my last day of school, <laughs> so that's pretty exciting. Tomorrow I get my final grades and stuff, but that's all I have to get back for. Nice. So I'm super excited for that. And as soon as tomorrow's over, I don't have to f set foot in that building ever again. Yay! Well, I'll miss it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'll miss college. <laughs> but I got b bigger, better things to go on to. Yep. I have to go look for a job of some sort. <laughs> oh, I'm off to university. <laughs> <laughs> Can we do into animations? Yay! Oh! <laughs> that does that. That doesn't surprise me. Because you're you're definitely into those animations. I'm getting better, slowly. <laughs> well, I like the animations you do, so. It's still just like beginner stuff, though. And it, everything's still a little bit awkward with the timing and everything. Although I, it's like with all the other things, you just need practice. Yeah, but I think the like I I, I um like the, the things you do for uh, for verses, those are usually really good. I I, I really like those. <laughs> I'm working on one right now. Ah. Not for verses, but it's like it's got a couple of let's players in. I've just finished the animatic for it. Ah. <laughs> so be be sure to look out for that soon. Yep. Yay. Go subscribe to her channel right now if you're not already. <laughs> <laughs> this last submarine. And I still I still need to make my thank you video for over 1,000 subs. Yes, yes, you should. <laughs> <laughs> I, I keep. I have it all planned out. I wrote out like an entire script of stuff I need to say. <laughs> Where's that last sub? There it is. Yeah, Come back here. it's it's being it's being really really hard to hit. Ah, you just missed it. <laughs> yep, it's it's taking a lot of, it's taking a lot of turns and like so, all of a sudden it stops and it turns around and it makes it really annoying to hit. We should almost have it. Okay, come on. This is gonna take too long. I don't want to cut any of this out. Come on. Let me get a good lock on. Please. Jeez. Maybe. It needs to go into like a tunnel or something. That way you know vaguely where it's gonna be. Yeah. Ah! It's, al it's also because I'm like, I should try to stay right behind him, but it's not... It's working not really out. working out. See, he just turns around, he just turned around in the middle there and it... I wish I could just hit him without having to lock on, but I, I'm pretty sure you can, but it's really hard to do. Just the lock on makes it a lot easier. Well, if you, you get the lock on straight, and then you hit the tower. I had the okay. lock on that time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure by next week we'll have caught the submarine, guys. There we go! <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure by next week! <laughs> I don't want to go that far with that far. I don't want to go that long without eating. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you be you you be eating. I need food in you eat and I, and then you come back and I would still be doing that. Like <laughs> get back here. I want my money. 
<laughs> I'll sleep and then I'll wake up and you'll just be there. <laughs> <laughs> I'll still be sleep doing crap. that. So, like this area sleep. right here. Uh, there's a lot I can say about it. Um, the crabs are blue. That's one I've never thing. I've been into the super bonus area before, so this is new to me. Ah. <laughs> I never 100% did the game. I have uh, I have a couple of times. Well, I have a lot actually. The first time I saw this area, I was like, "Are you serious?" I was so proud when I beat this game, when I 100%ed this game before my cousin did, because he got to this world, but he could never figure out how to like beat this stage. And <laughs> I have to admit, this is the hardest mini game in the entire game. It is really, really hard. It looks super cool. Yeah. One thing you can do, I don't know if it's a glitch or not, but if you if you kill the crabs now, you don't have to worry about them later, or you don't have to worry about, well... I'm about to spoil what this is. It's gonna be another skateboard race. Well, you can kind of tell with Hunter, they're standing there with the skateboard, but yeah. Yeah, pretty it much. <laughs> but you can kind of, of the, tell. Yeah, all of the crabs you kill now, you won't have to worry about during the race, and you also don't have to worry about the other guys hitting them, because if they hit them, you don't get the, the boost out of it, so... It'll kind of start you with an advantage, which, with, with, uh, which, especially in this area, is really, really nice, because... I would like to get those gems if I can. There we go. Boop. These gems I'm picking up right now are the very last gems you'll find on the ground. After this, all of the gems you're gonna get are gonna be from these mini-games. Cool beans. Yep. And I think we almost have all of them, because we've almost gone full circle. There is that one crab uh, on a platform a little bit... Uh, like on a platform below you, you might have seen it while I passed it. I didn't really mention it. Like, it's right about there. Where you see that, uh, that alcove I'm pointing at right now? That's where it is. Yes. That's where the last gems are. <laughs> and I don't think I can make it up there... But I can... <laughs> it's like an invisible wall that he runs into. <laughs> yeah, some of these slopes are like too steep or something. I'm not exactly sure what's going on. I do believe there are some gems uh, in there, but... I'm not gonna worry about them right now. Right now it's time to actually start this race. Even though I haven't killed all the crabs, that's fine. Stock snowflakes! Yep. Just wanna point that out. <laughs> <laughs> I think for the very last time we're gonna see those. Stock snowflakes, no! 